Aku 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 If Joss is on fire, what of my brother? But I thought you said you were going to ring them on the phone. I said, but I, 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 I don't know. Oh, I honey, know. you're always careless with sensitive things until they get <sighs> out of hand. <laughs> oh. It's not connecting. Oh, goodness. Tadios. Tadios. Ah. When is he going to learn now and forget the past? And he, you contributed to everything by, by not communicating with your siblings. And they too now, they, they had to stay on their own. Oh, this is very unfortunate. Because at times like oh, this, God. we we all need one another. Oh. No luck. Good morning. Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Morning. Yeah. Good morning. Good You seem confused, Dad. What's the problem? Yeah, uh, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm really worried about uh, your uncle Thaddeus. <laughs> You haven't heard any news about them? Um, uh, Mommy and I called several times last night. No the phone kept ringing. There was no response. And I just heard in the news this morning that a whole community was ambushed and wiped out. Oh my God. Oh my God. Now, now I am really worried. Well, that's some serious news. My father, why don't you use your connections in the government to trace them? I mean, you have friends in the armed forces. You know, both of them have had this lingering disagreement since they were kids. Well, not in a time like this. I just pray Uncle Thaddeus and his family are safe wherever they are. I just don't know what this country is turning into. I pray so too. Well, I guess we all should be trying their numbers. Honey? Hmm? I'll get for you. I'll flash it to remind you. Two. I'll make it three. Chip, chip, people. See you, won't take it. Major Garba. Yes, it is of utmost importance to me. Yes. Uh, yes, I want you to pick some of your, your best men to go to the address I've just given you. Yes, to find out the whereabouts of my brother. Yes, my immediate junior brother and his family. Yes, um, General Abdul Karim said you are the best man. Uh, he's, he's, he's in Abuja, yes, at a meeting, yes, right now. Uh, please. Ah, uh, oh, thank you. I'm, I'm relying on you. Um, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Sir, I... Gabriel, I'm thinking. Oh, I'm thinking, Gabriel. I'm thinking. I just wanted to... Oh, will you shut up? Sorry, sir. Perhaps I should leave you now, sir. Shut up! Shut up! Gabriel. <coughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
look, if you had people in the war front as just has now become, then you will know my predicament right now. Uh, <coughs> I had no idea, sir. Have you got any news about them? No. 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 No, not at all. The news has been on CNN all day with gory pictures and mayhem. Oh, my God. Oh, God Almighty. Bring Thaddeus and his family home. Please. How many trips of laterite do we have left? About five, sir. About five. You know I don't like approximation. You should be exact. Izuchuku? Yes, sir. Switch off that television or change the channel. Okay, Dad. I assume you didn't get anything positive from Major Karuba. None. He went with a team of hand-picked men. To Thaddeus's place. It was uh, deserted and totally desolate. And they are now looking around uh, at all the places that people fled to. Hope that uh, he will have some cheery news for us by morning. But Dad, what I don't understand is why Uncle Thaddeus would choose not to communicate with us at a time like this. No, you know that dad and uncle don't have a very good relationship going on. Well, but not at a time like this. Dad. I really do not understand why you are not in good terms with your brothers and sisters. And why you don't talk to grandma. I'll be in the bedroom. I, I hope it wasn't anything I said. No, I don't think it's anything. something you said. You must understand that your father is under a lot of pressure right now. He's not being in good terms with his siblings. He's a major concern to him. Hello? Hello? Hmm? Hmm? Honey, your brother, your brother. Uh, Thaddeus. Thaddeus. Oh, hello? Yeah. Hello? Thaddeus. Thaddeus. Uh, hello? 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 Thaddeus.
have a memory. Everything is happening. What is happening is that I have a flat battery and nobody's responding to the knock on the gate. Hi. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what there's to do. Anybody home? Madam, what did they happen now? This way they're very sick of. Mom, I don't want anything to happen to my brother. I do something. Oh. Oh. Then, uh, please hold on. Eh? Yeah. Mom, the God who has brought us this far can not suddenly abandon us. Can you? Daddy. Mama. Sorry. You're fine. You'll be okay, eh? Hospitals at um, Makodi. That was where he was given first aid, and that is all. He's running the temperature. I think the wound is infecting. Him. Tadius, how did this happen? Oh God. We survived by his grace. Mm. Brother, he was stabbed. What? Um, as we were trying to escape ourselves to the park, something happened. Seven people were killed before our presence. So we panicked. We took different directions and um, they thought Tobinna was actually dead. Oh. Before our presence. Oh. Praise <sighs> God. Listen, I think we need to send him to the hospital immediately. We don't have money. You are here safely in my house and you're talking about money. <laughs> um, we just want to have a night rest. Then in the morning, I'll get to one of my old friends, uh, raise some money and take him to the hospital. What in God's name are you talking ah. about? Very mean and wicked. Listen, he's simply pretending because we're in his house. I know him very well. No, you don't know what you are doing. 
You just want your bride and whatever foolish dispute you have between you and your brother to affect our son. Akwaba Chietobe now is dying, can't you see it? Please, Daddy. I don't want to die. I'm tired. It's going to happen to you, okay? Hmm? First thing tomorrow morning, I'll go and get money and save you the hospital, okay? This I'm is done. very stupid. Very, very stupid. How could you say that? Come down. See, I am going out there to ask them to assist us. For what? Look, if you nurse this kind of hatred for your brother, why are you here? What is wrong with you? Listen, let Forget me. Forget about your pride. Just listen to me. Okay? We came here because we have no other option. When I needed his help, he turned me down. I don't want anything that he's going to do after he will use it against us. Don't you understand me? Oh I please beg you. This is our son's life. This is Tobinna's life, please. I beg you in the name of God. Let them help us. It's okay, listen, listen. You don't even have an idea how or what transpired between me and my brother. You don't know. I know Ethel bed too well. He is happy wherever he is. He's happy because we are suffering. Can't you read it? I promise you, if anything happens to my son, if anything happens Calm to down. my son, Nothing is happening to our son, okay? I will kill you. And I will kill myself. Do you hear me? It's okay now. Do you hear me? Please calm down. If you know what to do to him, take him to the hospital. Don't you ever touch him. I said it's okay. I don't want to hear your voice again. Don't talk to me again. If you want to help him, take him to the hospital. Now! Because I will kill you and I will kill myself. It's okay. Nobody's going to kill himself or you, whatever. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> what reason? Tell me, what reason? Have I not shown that I'm concerned? Very worried about them. Look, I am more affected because of that poor child than his father's foolishness. He's a younger brother. And you know, the relationship between both of you is not cordial. Maybe he wants you to convince him that... That what? That the trouble caused by his mother has lingered on until it has affected our children or even endangered their lives. Father, calm down, all right? I'm going to speak to him to take the boy to the hospital. Wait, obviously he doesn't want to. So are we just going to fold our hands and watch Tobina die just because dad and uncle Tejos are all over heads? I'll talk to him. I'm a medical student. Now if he doesn't send that boy to the hospital as soon as possible, it's going to get worse. Well, I'm a law student and um, I know when to mind my own business. I'm going back to bed. <clears throat> he will come back to his senses when he realizes that he needs me. Oh yes, I grew up alone. I didn't have a mother to tend my needs like them. Are we going to let this continue? When it is apparent that Dad and Uncle Tadeus are just allowing their pride to overrule their true sense of reasoning. Did you hear that? Is this how you're going to let our son die? Is this because of your foolish pride? Tell me that you're sorry. Please don't let my son die. 
You need to stop this. It's not enough already. I'll take him to the hospital. Oh, wait, now we'll take him now. No. Enough is enough. We are taking him to the hospital. Nina, go and call your father. And that won't be necessary. And eh? I will take him to the hospital. Devil, you're a liar. You can't take away my son from me. I know that. Please, I beg you. Please, just let me die. Jesus. Jesus. Go get Papa. to the hospital. Uh, as his uh, father agreed. Daddy, what are you talking about? The boy is at the point of death and whether Uncle Tedious agrees or not, we need to take him to the hospital, please. Well, tell your mother to do something about it. <coughs> Daddy, you need to do something about this cough. See what you can do with the mother. Uh, um, tell Namdi to take the boy to the hospital at once. <coughs> I, I know how you feel, but I still think you need to come along. All right, um, I'll come and see the boy later. Huh? And you need to see a doctor as well. Is he okay? Yes, he's fine. We managed to resuscitate him. But the doctor said there is a need to suture the wound immediately. So as to prevent a further infection of the wound. Yes. A further deposit of 50,000 Naira will be required, sir. Oh. No. Can the doctor give us some time to raise cash? We just came into town yesterday. Uh, uh, Please, let me handle this. No, no, no. You've done enough. Let me handle it myself. He's my son. Can I see the doctor? Why not? But I assure you, it won't make any difference. Uncle, uncle, please. Uncle. Uncle. Martin, can I just see you first? Okay, if you don't mind, excuse me. He's hurting Dad. I don't know. I really don't know. He's the one that kept saying that once we get to the elder brother's house, that all will be fine. I don't know what is wrong with me. It's okay, Eunice. I will not let whatever difference he has with his brother affect to Ben. It's okay. 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 Uncle, with all due respect, but I think both of you just bury your differences, all right? I know my father hasn't lived up to expectations, but please, just bury your differences. Um, young man, you've spoken well, but I have to take care of my responsibility. He's my son. I understand what you're saying. And I understand you went through a lot in Joss. But, 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 but listen, it, it, it just allow us to take charge. Just allow us to help you out, uncle, all right? With the younger generation, we're just not going to sit there for blood to flow in the family. Um, Nandi, my son, I thank you very much. I want to say that you have your mother's kindness and generosity. But you have to allow me to do this. Okay? You have to. Um, let me get along.
Yeah, uh, yeah I, I have to be in the office early. I have an early meeting. Izu, Izu, he too has an early class. He's gone, he's gone, yes. And I cannot leave Jama with the, with the house help. Ah, what about you? You're still in the hospital? Aren't you going to school? I told my school that I will be coming to school today. How is my uh, brother's ego faring? <laughs> my dear, thank you. Thank you for being you. No, I wouldn't have known what to do without you. Honey, you know what? He's with the doctor right now. You know, you're, you and your brother are so stubborn. But it's okay. If I can handle one, I can handle the other. Of course. Well, keep me informed. Huh? Okay. All right, dear. Bye bye. Are you enjoying your food? Good, good. Well, your mommy and daddy will soon be here. And uh, your cousin Nena will take you out to buy you some new clothes. Hmm? Good. Big daddy. Hmm? Yes, can I ask a favor for you? Can you ask a favor of me? Yes, sir. I am like your father. You are like my daughter. Now, why wouldn't I want to hear or do anything for my daughter? What can I do for you? Me, Daddy. Mm -hmm. I don't want my brother to die. Will you help him? But yeah, I will. I will do anything. Your brother alive. He will not die. Hmm? Thank you, sir. Thank you. I understand you wanted to know what the case is precisely like. Yes, doctor. Uh, the patients have become effective and um, endocardiatic and gas gangrene. And I believe you understand what that can amount to. Are you trying to tell me he has clostodium? Yes, clostodium, perfringens. And if that is the case, I wonder where in the whole country where we can get that facility to contain such a massive bacterial area. Are you trying to say to be now die? No, I haven't said that. Rather, I have instructed the laboratories to conduct a further antigenic controlling of the specimen so that we can determine, you know, the custodium that he has. And I believe if that's the case, he might die after all. He knows what he's doing. He's my brother, my younger brother. But his mother's blood that flows in his vein. Mean, wicked, and extremely vindictive. surprised about this whole thing. Does that mean that what Uncle Tadio said about you is true? Mm. Oh. oh, yes. And there has been no love lost between us. But I am, uh, I am willing to atone 
for all my mistakes by doing, by helping in any capacity. I mean, he was bitter. The, the way he sounded, I never expected him to ever sound like that. I mean, I'm sure he's been nursing that thing in him for a while now. Yes. Well, the problem is that um, I have tried several times to atone for the uh, uh, mistakes that I, uh, that, I, that, I, that I created. But my brothers and sisters will not give me a chance. <laughs> they believe I want to mock them because I, I am more successful. Father, that's not good at all. I mean, nobody knows tomorrow. And then you must do your possible best to make peace reign. But you know, you've not really told us the children what really transpired. I mean, all we know is just some knowledge about how you were treated when you were a kid by his mother when grandmother died. Son, I don't like to recall. You all know that uh, I am the only child of my mother and uh, my mother was the first wife of my father. Well, she suffered many early pregnancy complications. As a matter of fact, she had seven miscarriages before I stayed and she, she had me. She was so overjoyed and relieved. My father too was very, very happy. But his family, they began to put pressure on him to marry another wife. Just in case my mother had a problem having another child. So my, my father married another wife. And that is uh, your uncle Thaddeus's mother. The moment she came into the house, all hell was let loose. She began her manipulation until she was able to turn my father against me and my mother. Mommy, I feel pain. Pains? To be now where? My jaw. Your jaw? Maybe, maybe I should go and call the dog. Mommy, please hold me. I should hold you. Okay. Okay, I'm, I'm holding Mommy, you. Please hold me. God. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm holding you. God, you know the best. God, you know I can't challenge you. I know you're going to save my son. Please don't cry. No, 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 I'm not crying. I'm not. What is it? I can't breathe. What? Tobinna. Tobinna. Tobinna, please, Tobinna. loved me so much, who pampered me with, the, with all sorts of gifts, suddenly turned against me. He not only disliked me, but I saw hate in his eyes. hated my mother more. <coughs> Sorry. Oh. 
ago, we knew what deprivation was. Ah, <laughs> we shared the same room with hunger and total deprivation. My mother's sold her farmlands, her economic trees, all to no avail. Oh, she will sit up all night, cry, cry bitterly, with no one to give us a call. Nurse, prepare the emergency ward and don't forget to alert Prof immediately. Uh -uh. Doctor, what is going on? You can huh? see for yourself, man. The pen now wants to leave on the wall. This is an emergency. I'll need to move into the intensive unit fast. No, Doctor. Doctor, please. is it going to be alright? Just tell us what is happening. Tobena, you cannot leave us. No, that is here, okay? Hmm? You're telling the children stories that will stir up spite and malice. Just the truth, but they're just the truth. No uh, wicked intentions. They need to know the truth. But this is not fair now. Your brother's son is dying at the hospital. Oh. God, this is so ridiculous. Mom. Daddy meant no harm. He was only trying to let us into the genesis of his problems with Uncle Thaddeus. Yes, but my father, really. What, what seems to be the problem? Why do you have a bad relationship? What is it based on? I grew up with hun hatred for them. Not that, but don't you think that if you go and tell Uncle Thad is the truth, he's gonna forgive you? Yeah. Dad, listen. I feel your pain. Daddy, we understand your ambivalence. But don't you think it's high time you put all this behind you in the interest of peace? I mean, if you showed up at the hospital now. Hello? Yeah, Eunice. What is it? Oh, my God. Ah. What is it, Mom? Mommy. Oh. Well, there is nothing left for us to do. I'd want to wait for the doctors to come out of the uh, theater with Ravenna. This is not fair. How can you allow us to continue suffering after all that we've been through? Even if it's okay, he will be fine. Just put yourself together, okay? It's okay. Daddy, I think you should talk to Uncle Sergius. Just call him aside and talk to him. Yes, Dad, I, I, I suggest the same. Dad, and why don't you put away whatever sentiment is going through your mind and reach out to Uncle before it's too late? Papa, I can't take this thing any longer. If you can't talk to him, I'll talk to him myself. Namde, sit down. <laughs> it is my duty to make peace with my brother, not you. Then if you keep hesitating, we'll take the bull by the horn. We'll do it ourselves. Go. 
Rajas. <laughs> Rajas. Where are you going? I'm perplexed. I'm just walking around. I don't understand. I understand. Um, why don't we walk this way? Yeah, yeah. I want to have a chat with him. You know? Are you happy now? That was what he asked me. How could my brother, my own brother, think that the death of his son will make me happy? Daddy, you should understand how he feels. Maybe he expected more from you. Yeah. Was I not willing to help? Did I not try to assist? Did he give me the opportunity? Oh. Why don't you go to his room and talk to him? I've tried to, but he doesn't want to listen. Doesn't. After all the little boy went through, he still had to die at the end of the day. Daddy, is it possible you stop smoking? <laughs> and, and do something about this cough because it's getting worse by the day. Mm. My husband's mind is scattered. His dreams and aspiration. Alafa, it's only God that can touch his mind. Because what we went through will truly affect his mind. Yes. Oh. I wish there was a way I could appeal to his conscience. Oh, let him allow my husband to help him. They are brothers. Olai, do you know that we would have avoided this place if we had the options? That's sad. That's so, so sad. Hey, I am finished. Oh, I am gone. No, no, yes, the Lord is just finished. Tobinda is dead. Allah, yes. Suffered so much. Suffered so much, my son. Oh. But big dad, promise me that Tobena won't die. <laughs> Shh. He's not your daddy, okay? He's not part of us. Hmm? Yes. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Tobina was only just hanging on to life. Yeah, but maybe he would have made it if he was given proper medical attention. Or better still, if he was flown abroad. No, no, no. Dad has the connections. No, 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 no. Listen, I'm a medical student and I know better. This case was just mismanaged. I mean, he just wasn't taken to the right hospital at the right time. Maybe he was stabbed with a poison dagger. No, this is what. I don't think so. That would just make the differences just worse. I mean, Uncle Thaddeus is just looking for somebody to blame. Someone to blame? Why? Dad never offered to take charge. So no one can blame you for anything. You know, I don't like this thing at all. I just don't like what is going on. This is just settle the differences and then everybody will be fine. Nobody knows tomorrow. That's what I'm saying. This is just... I don't know, he's just moving his things out. such a decision without letting neither my husband nor myself to know. Um, I'm sorry.
Hey, put this behind you. It's the same girl that gives that takes. Oh, that's your oh. Undo. Hey! <laughs> hey, that boy. Hey. That boy wanted to leave. He fought so hard to leave. All the way from Joss. Yodle, to come and dine in a tell's house. Hey. Why? Why? Don't talk like this now. How can you talk like this? You see it for yourself. I never bury any of my children. Now, I will just bury my. Mama, Mama, don't talk like this. Mama, it is okay. It's okay. Hey, tell, why do you allow this to happen? You are allowed to bend not to die. Mama, aren't you listening? Thaddeus! I'm talking to you! Thaddeus, come here! Did you tell her that I offered you on, on, to take that boy to the hospital and pay the bill and you said no? Thaddeus, my dad is talking to you. I don't blame you. My dad is talking Your to my son! son. No, was anyone that killed his son? They still offered to give him money and he declined? Why is he working out on that? He has no right to work out on that. He has no right. He's taking after you. Why? Why? Is this blood? Is there blood running in You! You my mother. You her. You her. I've been keeping quiet because I wanted to be to take this accepted. To me, no, you not You see? That's what's wrong with all these village people. Each time you come to the village, the same story. Oh my God. to you. That's right. Guys are feeling bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about what happened earlier today. But the thing is, someone needed to tell them the truth. You know how these villagers behave. And Uncle Thaddeus had no right to disrespect Daddy. Izu, no one is blaming you for your actions, but you just don't go full blown. You apply diplomacy. I don't care. I've already been declared a rebel. I'd rather remain one than take rubbish from anybody. I'm just disappointed that Dad and Uncle Thaddeus were not able to settle their differences as usual. They all having their big egos. Hmm. Did you guys see how grandma was just glaring at dad? Did you hear the things she said to him? Exactly. Gosh. That's what I'm talking about. I saw naked envy and hatred in her eyes. That just that's why I don't like this village. Listen, what we need to do as children is not to disappoint our parents because they've invested so much into our future that we can't afford to lose, all right? Isn't it obvious that we're on our own? We have enemies all around us. We're on our own. Who cares? I don't need anybody. Very soon, I'll be graduating as a lawyer. And God help anyone who crosses that path. So deal with the person. And that's what you need to work on. You need to work on your temperament. You're just too vulnerable. You have to learn from me. You have to learn from your sister, all right? My dear, I, 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 I disagree with you. Yes, and I think it is unfair <coughs> to say now that uh, we are now vulnerable. The world is mean and wicked, and, and only the strong survive. Ah, Jesus' outburst, yes, uh, may be condemned by all, but. He was fighting for his father. Honey, I am not disputing that. <coughs> what I'm saying is that you were expected to at least caution him. You know, a sort of <coughs> reprimand to at least calm down frayed nerves. I am not a hypocrite. I stand by what I believe in, which is what has brought me to where I am in life. I want peace with my uh, siblings, yes. <coughs> but that does not make me uh, a coward. 
Honey, what are no, you... No, 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 no. We, we cannot embrace. No, we cannot. <coughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. <coughs> sorry. <coughs> Honey? <coughs> is that not blood? Honey? Uh, my, my, my throat is sour, is sour. Very sore. And, uh, I, 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 my chest, my chest is as if it's laden with lead. Honey, you've had this cough for some time. <coughs> what is really driving me crazy is that you're not taking it serious. My dear, it is nothing to worry about. As soon as we get to the next, um, drugstore, I will take a drug or two. <coughs> <laughs> it will be alright. <laughs> Why don't you just forget about this poison that is killing your lungs? <laughs> this, 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 this is not necessary. It's not necessary. Do you, do, do you want us to fight another fight over, over my, my habits? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's easy, easy, easy. Sorry. <laughs> oh. I, I have good news for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. S sit down, sit down, sit down. <laughs> uh, sorry, I, I, I clearly forgot. <laughs> you know, your application to another school, as principal, has been approved by the ministry. <laughs> Honey, 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 honey. It's okay, take it easy. Take it easy. Personally, supervise cleaning of the office. Well, I, I like the, I like the clean and tidy environment. Certainly, madam. Yeah, good. I would like to finish the tour. I hope all the house mistresses are around because I would like to address them when we get to the dormitory. Yes, madam. Except for one person, who has the habit of not coming to school often. Why? She's a real character. Uh, I would rather say troublesome. Everyone avoids her. No, 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 no. Not on my watch. She better sits up or leaves. I don't, I don't condone inconsistency and bad influence. Can you please take me to the dormitory? Thank you.
this way. Ahmed. Uh, sir. Good afternoon. Ahmed, what is it? One man, Minister Tolga. One man? Yes, sir. From where? From court. Court? Where is the man? It's outside the gate. Man. Okay. 